Hi everyone, I'm Kimberly Pendell. I'm the Social Work and Social Sciences Librarian at Portland State University, and I am an advocate for open access. When I first became a social work librarian, I noticed this gap between a push for evidence-based or evidence-informed practice in the field and then actually having access to the research that's supposed to inform that practice. Um, the traditional publishing model is based on expensive subscription access and it doesn't really allow for people unaffiliated with a university uh, to be able to read that research. So once our social work students leave, the, they're unlikely to really have the same amount of access to research ever again. Um, open access publishing changes this. Open access journals have different funding models that prioritize making content freely and publicly available. Another means of sharing research is via disciplinary or institutional repositories like PDX Scholar. And in that case, the authors can put a version of their article um, up in that archive and make it available to everyone. So the first step that I've taken in terms of supporting access to research for social workers uh, was to create an open access social work guide. So this guide, uh, has links to journals in the field of social work that make their content either fully or at least partially available uh, freely and publicly. And in the guide, I also highlight databases and search engines like PubMed and Google Scholar that can provide an entryway also to finding articles and um, research that is either open access or again in one of those uh, disciplinary or institutional repositories that I mentioned. So I send this guide out to graduating students every year in hopes that it provides them some starting point for um, their practice and being able again to access some research. Uh, in addition to the guide, I've been researching the, this tension that I mentioned between the push in the field for evidence-based or evidence-informed practice and the lack of access to it. So um, in a citation study of, 20 of the, 25 of the top journals in social work, I found that less than half of the articles could be accessed um, unless you're affiliated with an institution. And most of the ones that could be accessed were in kind of a tenuous way and that they were posted in places where publishers are really likely to issue a takedown notice and then that item will disappear from the web. So um, in summary, I am an advocate for open access in the field of social work, and I believe it's vital that social workers and their communities be able to directly access the research that's gonna impact their practice and their lives. Thanks.